Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the SIM unlocking of a mobile device in order to be used with a different carrier or different network than the one that originally sold it. By default, most mobile devices are going to come with some sort of lock that restricts them to only being used with the original carrier, and they have to undergo some sort of unlock process in order to be used with a different carrier or different network. Here with us today we have a LG K7 that is originally from Metro PCS here in the U.S., also known as Metro by T-Mobile. And this is a device that has not yet been SIM unlocked from Metro. As we can see here with a different carrier SIM card, we get this message here telling us that it is network locked and to use Metro's device unlock application in order to unlock it. And then if we dismiss that, we'll also see on the lock screen here we get a message that says service provider locked. And if we swipe that away, we will also see that same message at the bottom of the notification panel here. So those are basically how you know that the device is still locked to its original carrier is if you're seeing those messages and indications. Now, in regards to that device unlock app, that is something that is preloaded by Metro here on the device, and that app is basically how they control the official SIM unlocking that they will do for you if you meet all of their requirements. But Metro usually requires that you be the original owner of the device, that you have it fully paid off, and that you have it active with them for a certain number of days or months. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific device, usually either because they themselves wanted to change carriers before uh, meeting all of Metro's requirements for them to do the unlock, or because they purchased the device used from a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the lock was enabled. The seller claimed that it was already unlocked or that it was already eligible to be unlocked through Metro or something like that, and then after the buyer made the purchase, they discovered that was not true and the seller had long since disappeared and couldn't be contacted anymore. It's a very common scam that happens these days with the buying and selling of mobile devices, unfortunately. So we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to get this device SIM unlocked and without having to go through Metro and meet all of their requirements. It's something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer, and that's actually exactly what we're doing right here right now while the phone is plugged in, just to be able to show you the before and after as proof that it can actually be done. The great thing about this procedure is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world, so you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection, and we can remotely connect directly to your computer through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we're doing right here right now. I should mention that since this device only has GSM capability, once it is unlocked, it is only usable on GSM carriers. So in the United States, currently, that would be any carrier that currently uses either AT&T towers or T-Mobile towers. So any CDMA carriers like Verizon or US Cellular or any of the smaller regional ones, this device would not work with them, unfortunately, because it does not have the internal components necessary to run on a CDMA network. Our unlock program is just about finished up running here. We need just about another few seconds or so for it to be able to run through. And actually, I think it, yep, it just wrapped up there. So the device is going to restart now. And then we should be able to see after that that we can indeed get signal and register on the test SIM card that we have here inserted and also without seeing any of those error messages. Okay, so you will notice right away, instead of the network provider lock, it just said searching there, and then that changed to say Cricket, which is the provider of the SIM card that we have inserted. And then if we go ahead and swipe away the lock screen, you'll obviously notice that we don't have that network locked message there anymore. So that is gone. It's also not visible in the notification panel where it was before. Instead, it just now shows the name of the network, which again is Cricket. I'm going to jump into the settings here just to show you exactly what's going on. So if I go under network, there we go. We can indeed see that we are registered here on Cricket, which is a prepaid provider here in the U.S. that runs on AT&T's network. And then the mobile network type there, LTE, everything's set up. We've got our messages popping in from Cricket because they detect a new device. So the device is fully now SIM unlocked and totally usable on any GSM carriers, both here in the U.S. and also in other countries.
I'll also jump into the hardware info here just to show you exactly what we're working with. So that model number there, the LG MS330 is what we're working with here. And again, that is the LG K7 originally from Metro. So if you have an LG K7 from Metro and would like help getting it SIM unlocked, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the details there as well. Make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel while you're here, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy sometime along the way. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos hispanos hablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.